Hello everyone, I hope you are all doing great today. My name is Faraz and I'm here with another feature release update video with something very exciting. It is the new drag and drop builder for your opt-in forms and landing pages. Without any further ado, let's jump straight to it. All right, the first thing you will notice is the new design. So we've completely moved away from the linear and boring layout that used fields and moved to a more modular design tab, which literally allows you to drag and drop the elements of your opt-in form or landing page. Previously, you were limited to using the components of the template that you chose for your form. Now, however, you can select the layout and then design it in any way you'd like. You are able to edit and modify every element of your form in a number of different ways. All right, moving on to the next great feature. We've introduced a way for you to save template blocks for later use. So if there are certain elements that you use on a regular basis, such as the header or CTA section, instead of creating it from scratch every time, you can just create it once, save it, and use it again later from saved template blocks. You are now also able to change the width of your form by measuring it in pixels. So instead of just the four standard size options, you now have the option to set your form width down to the pixel. Another great feature in the new drag and drop builder is platform specific content. So you can choose to hide a row from your form for mobile users or desktop users. So for example, I've built a form featuring a specific image for each platform. I'll just go ahead and hide the one which I don't need for mobile or desktop. And last but definitely not least is the new stock images widget which gives you access to millions of stock images for free. This widget uses stock image libraries from Unsplash, Pixels and Pixabay giving you access to millions of licensed and royalty free images readily available for your forms. It is as easy as grabbing the image you need onto your form. So these are just a few pointers to get you guys started on the new feature but of course the new drag and drop builder is capable of so much more. So go ahead and give it a try, make a form, make a landing page and at any stage if you need any help at all feel free to click on the help icon on the bottom right and our team will be able to help you out. I'll see you guys in the next one.